This is Democracy Now! I'm Amy Goodman with Nermeen Sheikh. So, uh, Anuntati, you're one of six public intellectuals in India who criticized the arrest of WikiLeaks founder and editor-in-chief Julian Assange in London last month. In a statement, the sig signatories of the statement called for his immediate release, writing, quote, the journalism WikiLeaks and its editor-in-chief stand for is a journalism of outrage, outrage against the injustices and atrocities that take place around the world, but also with an eye to factuality, substantiation and precision. If the U.S. had charged Assange and WikiLeaks for publishing classified material, the legal case would have been no different from charging The New York Times with publishing the Pentagon Papers, the statement said. In Sweden, prosecutors are now reopening an investigation into sexual assault allegations against WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange and are seeking his extradition to face the charges in Sweden. The U.S. is also seeking Assange's extradition over the publication of leaked documents by Army whistleblower Chelsea Manning, which showed evidence of U.S. war crimes in Iraq. So this latest news that just broke today, um, many people feel that um, that. Sweden has been under enormous pressure to say they've reopened an investigation on sexual assault and rape charges against Assange, um, so that uh, he will also be called uh, back to Sweden, and that ultimately what he's most concerned about is being extradited to the United States. He has said he doesn't want to be sent to Guantanamo Bay. Why have you gotten involved with this case? And these latest allegations today, do they concern you? Well, I met Assange a few years ago at the Ecuadorian embassy. I uh, was an, um, an admirer of WikiLeaks. The trouble is, of course, that there's a sort of, uh, you know, th these issues of sexual assault are separate, in my mind, from the idea of his extradition to the U.S. Now, I don't know, I'm unable to read what this new uh, demand by Sweden is, is it really to try him for rape, or is it because uh, the U.S. feels it can get him extra uh, extradited from Sweden easier than it can from England, from London? I don't know. You know, I don't know. But I think, um, I think it's absolutely right that if you are going to send Julian Assange to Guantanamo Bay, then you're really attacking people who publish um, news that the world needs to know, you know. Although the charge against him, they're trying to say, is that he, he was trying to help and encourage Chelsea Manning to hack into the uh, Pentagon computers, you know, which I think is a flimsy charge. Many journalists are deeply con concerned about this, because when uh, they are working with a source and the source says, how do I get this information to you, um, uh, it is very difficult when the government says, you solicited this, um, when a source is trying to be protected and trying to figure out the safest way to get information they feel is critical to understanding, in this case, war, Iraq war, Afghanistan war, State Department memos. It's, 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 it's outrageous, basically, because w what about all the, all the documents that Snowden leaked? You know, people have published them. Are they going to be put into prison? You know, uh, what about the people who helped Snowden to escape? Are they going to be put into prison? You know, where does this end then? You know, so it's 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 a it's a, it's a very serious uh, uh, step. It's not about Assange. It's not about whether he's a nice man or a not nice man, or whether he raped someone who didn't. If he did, he should be punished for it. That's a separate matter from this. And uh, we oughtn't to get into this uh, mess about, oh, you know, would it be, would it be, is it okay because you like him or you don't like him? It's not about him as a person. I don't know him personally. And uh, if he has indeed um, raped somebody, he should be punished for that. But that is not the same thing as the WikiLeaks enterprise, and that enterprise concerns us all, all of us.